Patau syndrome. Patau syndrome or trisomy 13 is the result of either a complete or partial extra copy of chromosome number 13. There are two major types of Patau syndrome. The first, duplication trisomy 13, is when there is a complete extra copy of chromosome number 13. The second and less common is translocation trisomy 13. This is when a part of an extra 13th chromosome attaches onto a different chromosome. Duplication trisomy 13 is not inheritable. However, translocation trisomy 13 can be. A human without trisomy 13 can have something called a balanced translocation. This is when part of a chromosome is translocated, but it doesn't affect the person. This trait can be passed down and can cause genetic disorders such as Patau syndrome in the offspring. Signs and physical symptoms of Patau syndrome include unusual facial characteristics, cleft lip and palate, polydactyly and abnormalities in genitalia, and emphalocele. Other symptoms of Patau syndrome include seizures, mental issues, and stunted growth. There is no cure for Patau syndrome, but surgery can be done to remove the cleft lip and palate and to fix any heart problems. Despite this, there are often too many problems to fix and the child ends up dying. In fact, 90% of the babies with Patau syndrome die within the first year of life. One in 5,000 live births is diagnosed with Patau syndrome yearly in the US. To diagnose Patau syndrome, an analysis, analysis of the cells to get a karyotype is needed. To harvest the cells, it can be done by amniocentesis, blood sample, or using cells from the placenta. Fetal ultrasounds can help to suggest trisomy 13, but they are not at all accurate. There are funds dedicated to help prevent and prolong the life of people with Patau syndrome. One of these such funds is Hope for Trisomy 13, which donates money to research foundations.